I love chenille, but I don't love to slash the channels open because my hands get tired. Hi, I'm Hope Yoder and I'm with Embellish, manufactured by r &K Distributing. We have a brand new tool that goes along with our Embellish Maker software program. So this software program is brand new and what everybody loves about it is we have auto features. I could take an applique design like on this project. This is our quilted door stopper CD and it's filled with fish aquarium gravel rocks. Let me turn this upside down so we can get a close-up shot of the flamingo. So the embroidery collection comes with all of the designs that you can make this cute in the hoop door stopper but it also comes with the original SVG artwork. So that's important, you can make a lot of fun things with it. But if I also have Embellish Maker software, I could take that applique design and in one click, I could turn the body into chenille, fluffy chenille. And there's a video on how I made this t-shirt on our Embellish Maker software page. But you can see the difference between these two. We've got fluff, and we've got the regular applique. Now with that, I also have taken and made some samples to show you to demonstrate. This is our new uh, winter critter embroidery collection. It's a beautiful collection and, and if you see the quilt behind me, it's created um, with this CD. In fact, the whole quilt directions are on this CD. But we took one of the little designs and this is a beautiful raw edge applique and we added a little chenille right across the cuff. And then we took another design from there and we mixed a bunch of different media, but we have chenille here. And on the back, the whole back of the stocking is just one big ball of soft fluff with chenille. All right, so that's what chenille is. And here's the new cutter. So the problem that I had with using um, the other chenille cutters is my hand would get so tired. And because especially doing something like the back of a stocking, you really have to uh, continue to have hand movement. And nothing was ergonomic. Nothing had a nice soft grip. So the longer I used it, the more my hands cramped up. So this is an ergonomic chenille cutter. And the name of it is Comfort Grip chenille cutter and the reason is it's got a nice soft grip here and it also comes with an interchangeable uh, guide we have a short and a long and why would you need both well i use the long one for straight chenille and if you happen to have designs with a short curved chenille or a curved chenille then you can just replace this with a shorter blade and that goes through curved areas so let me demonstrate how to use this get all this out of your way and so here's just a, a little square. I took it into Embellish Maker software. One click of the mouse, it turned a square into chenille. And so the process um, for that is normally you're going to lay down a foundation fabric and that's going to tack it down. And then you're going to lay three layers of cotton fabric. And you'll notice these are not the same. And then it stitches these channels of chenille. To get the fluff, we have to slice between them. So here's a little tip. When you are slicing between them, let me turn it this way to the back side. Notice I kind of trim close. We have extra fabric here. And if I wanted to use this um, to get it started, I'm going to go ahead and just trim close to the edge of the stitching line. And you can see I'm not being careful. That's the beauty of chenille. It is so stinking fun and you don't have to worry about getting close enough. But I trim the excess floppy part off and then with scissors and then to use this, there's no open and close like you're used to on a regular chenille cutter. It's always open and this little guard protects your hands so that the blade never is going to um, accidentally cut you. And I'm going to slip that long thing in there and then I just hold it. And you guys, you know, let me just do this. This is for your thumb, depending on if you're left or right handed. It is ambidextrous, works for either. And you may want to rest your hand or you may want to rest your thumb, but I'm barely, let me just do it with a couple um, fingers here so you can see that I really don't have to use much effort to get it going. It's really slick. And then you just take a brush and you're going to rough it up. And when you do that, you get this beautiful, fluff called chenille. So a couple things about the cutter. 
I showed you that it comes with an optional, let me put this down here so we have a little contrast. It comes with the optional guide and to change the blade, that's on the back. And to do that, you're just going to pull open and it's a little harder on purpose because we don't want you to accidentally do that. And when you do that, it takes off uh, the assembly and you can just replace the blade. Now what's really nice about this cutter is that blade is going to last you a very long time. And the reason, so I slipped it all back in there and I just um, push that up, make sure you tug on it so it's nice and secure. So this um, for storage, you could kind of go up. I'm not sure why you'd want to do that, but it does move on purpose. But the blade, people ask, how long is that blade going to last? What's well, going to last a really long time? Because this is a turn dial. And after you've used it for a while and it seems like you're having to tug on it, you're just going to turn this and it explodes, exposes a new fresh area of the blade. So next time you're doing chenille, Remember, Embellish Maker will make chenille out of existing applique designs or out of artwork in one click of a mouse. And then you're going to want our ergonomic cutter called the Comfort Grip Chenille. All right, and super easy, soft, it's really pretty, and it's going to help you love chenille even more than you already do.